My name is Jeremy, and I've been active in the USA Sepak Takra scene as a player and as an event organizer since 2007. I learned to play the sport in Oakland, California, um, where the local Lao community has been playing for nearly two decades. In 2010, I started traveling to Sacramento on a weekly basis to train with some of the best players in the United States. And I considered myself very lucky in 2011 when I got an opportunity to play on the U.S. national team for the 2012 and 2013 ISTAF Super Series tournament seasons. Um, I paid my own way to Indonesia, Thailand, and India in order to compete against some of the best players in the world representing the United States. And in 2013, our team stunned the world when we finished third in one of the most difficult competitions, um, the ISTAF Super Series tournament held in Bangkok, Thailand, where two of our matches were televised to more than 100 million people across 60 countries. It was around the time um, after my first or maybe my second trip to Asia for competition that I realized how much exposure Sepak Takra was getting overseas and how little exposure and how little attention the sport was getting here within the United States. Um, and I didn't really understand why Sepak Takra wasn't on the radar of the world's largest sports market. So I decided to travel the United States to meet as many players uh, from as many cities as I could and to get to know them and learn and understand their stories. What I heard was the same thing in each city that I went to. We used to have so many players, the sport used to be so big, um, there just aren't very many of us left now. The young players have decided to do something else. We don't have any young players. Um, and it was sad. You know, I realized that the sport that I loved was slowly fading away just as I was getting into it. Um, so I decided to take a more active role in the organization and promotion of Sepak Takra after a conversation that I'd had with my chiropractor, whose name is Ben Glass. He urged me to take a risk and to devote some serious time and energy to the sport that I loved. And he convinced me. Um, luckily, I wasn't alone. Um, there was a group of five former players from Minnesota who, in 2014, decided to form a nonprofit and corporation dedicated to supporting the growth of Sepak Takra within the United States. They called their organization Sepak Takra of USA, Inc. When I found out about them, I immediately joined them as a board member, and we've been working together ever since to bring new and exciting Sepak Takra opportunities to the United States. A lot of the work that we've been doing um, is under the radar. People don't know about it. But trust me, we're working very hard behind the scenes in order to promote, to educate, to host events, build courts, gain sponsorship for players, um, provide very low-cost equipment, and to create partnerships with overseas organizations. Now, I'm excited about our newest project because our hope is to rebrand Sepak Takra within the United States, not just uh, from a backyard sport to a jaw-dropping foot sport that's actually worthy of nationwide attention and organized league play. We're going to try to professionalize Sepak Takra. And in order to accomplish this, we're partnering with um, Marathon Thailand, which is the world's most well-known Sepak Takra equipment manufacturer. We're partnering with them to import a professional court mat and competition package, which we are going to use to stage professional Sepak Takra events here in the United States for TV programming. And we're going to do it in highly visible venues. So that's big news. In order to make this happen, Sepak Takra of USA Inc. needs to raise $3,000 to ship this professional court equipment from Bangkok, Thailand to Los Angeles, and then from Los Angeles to Las Vegas for the 2016 Sepak Takra Open in Las Vegas at SkillCon, and from SkillCon to its final resting place, which will be in Portland, Oregon at Rose City Futsal, a sports facility that has offered to house our court and allow us to stage these professional events within their venue. Um, right now, we've raised almost $1,500, um, 
And again, our goal is $3,000. So we're about halfway there, but time is running out. We've only got about 12 days left to go. Um, here are a few reasons why I think that you should become a part of this campaign and donate to support us. First, you might be a Takra player, but you've never even played on a real Takra court because you live in the United States where we don't have one. Second, if you are a Takra player and you're a good Takra player, good enough so that you have aspirations of joining the US team, you need to train on a real court in order to really stand a chance against international teams who have high-level coaches, state-of-the-art equipment, um, and excellent facilities. This is not going to be my court. It will belong to Sepak Takra of USA Inc. And our mission is to support the community, and therefore this court is going to be used by and belong to the community. It will be your court, your court, not mine. Having this court in the United States increases the chances that tournament organizers will be able to secure sponsorship and media attention. Now, increased media attention means more exposure for the sport that we all love. And sponsorship means, of course, increased prize money. So we all like prize money. Um, and lastly, with this court, we'll be able to produce better quality tournaments. Tournaments that look exciting and are exciting for spectators and for players. Because Sepak Takra of USA Inc. is a 501c3 incorporation, the donations that you make are tax deductible. So that's another piece of good news. Lastly, we need the Takra community. Not just players, but all the people who love Sepak Takra. Current players, former players, family, friends, we all need to unite behind this goal of supporting our sport. People around the United States deserve to know about the game of Sepak Takra. They deserve to know that it exists. They deserve to be taught uh, the sport within the PE curriculums at their public schools. And they deserve to be able to watch it on TV one day. I can't make these things happen alone. Sepak Takra of USA Inc. can't make it happen without your help. Let's come together as a community. Please, join me in supporting our effort to import this court, the United States' first professional Sepak Takra court, donated by Marathon Thailand. You can make a donation to our campaign fundraiser by going to our website at youcaring.com. Here's what the court is going to look like. It's going to be super cool and very professional. Again, you are supporting Sepak Takra of USA Inc., of which I am a board member. And with your help, one day we're going to have fans like this dude cheering us on the sidelines. I hope you'll help me make it happen. Thanks.